Hey, what's up you guys? I'm Jen Fox and this is your Cake's Country Dirt. Jelly Roll fans get excited if you're anxious for some new music from him. Jelly Roll says you might not have to wait that long. I wrote probably a hundred and something songs last year. I am sitting on a phone that is shaking out of my pocket with the spirit and soul in it that needs to be released in a way I can't even describe. I'm to the point where I'm finna just start releasing music, just doing it, I need to get it out of me. You know what I mean? It's therapeutic for me. And I got to see so much last year and meet so many people and experience so much. I, I do, I do how I, how I uh, uh, do dialogue best and I wrote in a song. As Outskirts becomes his latest smash hit, Sam Hunt is saying thank you to his fans. They mean the world to me. They're the other reason I have a career. Um, our fans specifically have been a unique uh, section of the country music fans. Um, a lot of our fans have uh, here, you know, over the years, aren't traditional country music fans, but now are, have, have sort of gotten on board through um, some of our music, which is always awesome to hear. Mega Maroney says there's actually a real life story behind her latest hit, I'm Not Pretty. I just love it because it's a confident anthem. I wrote it obviously about my ex-boyfriend's new girlfriend, accidentally liking a photo from 2016. Um, and then with the music video, I feel like I got to tell the bigger story of the song. Like when I sing I'm not pretty, I'm not thinking about my ex-boyfriend's new girlfriend. It's more so just like, keep telling me I can't do things. Like, you know, like that's the message of the song. And I just like how the music video is like, if you're nice, you're really good at baking cakes and you're really good at doing things. And if you're mean, you burn your cakes and look unhappy all the time. For Cakes 102.5, I'm Jen Fox and that's your country.